Good evening, Kingdom Saints. Good evening. Welcome. This evening I've decided to share to share a poem with you guys. It's called Letting Go. But first let me explain the substance and the meaning of this poem. This poem is about me when I met a beautiful, good hearted woman who I thought was gonna be the woman of my life, my soulmate. <laughs> but God had other plans. So I decided to let her go because she didn't want to come to Jesus. You know, it's a hard thing to do for a man to turn down such a opportunity as I had. But I put Jesus first. I put Jesus first, so she didn't want to come around. So we just went apart, went our own separate ways. But I hear in my soul, in my heart, I still love her. I still love her, but I love Jesus more. Amen. We had a good, a good, strong relationship, but the only thing missing was her belief and her letting go of the world that is, what she didn't want to do. But you know who you are if you look watching this video. I'm not going to mention names out of respect, but um, here it is. It's called Letting Go. <clears throat> my love, I had to let you go. The voice of my Father in heaven beckons unto me, and him I must follow. Will you follow me on the road to God's green pasture and life everlasting? Alas, you chose not to, even with all of my pleading even with all of my asking. Tis not the worldly things that I caress, but the love we share that lingers unto my very essence, my very inner being, that was put to the test. Tis a calling from heavenly places that I hearken to, for I hear and I obey the voice of my Father in heaven. I prophesy to you, Miha, my love, about Jesus and how you will receive all of his blessings. Alas, my love, in my heart you shall always stay, for I have hardened my heart to all evil and all temptations that pass my way. My Father in heaven is a compassionate Father and full of wisdom full of understanding and full of grace. Alas, my love, I long to meet my Savior Jesus in heaven face to face and to give unto him a warm embrace. Alas, my love, there will come a time when you believe everything is finished. That will be the beginning, you see. I shall follow the steps that God has outlined for me until I reach his heavenly habitation to live with him eternally. You told me once, Miha, my love, that you didn't believe in my Savior Jesus. You said, why bother? I told you, Miha, my love, that only through love can we obtain communion and communication with God the Father. I hearken unto you, Miha, to change your life. Let go and let God take control, lest I bid you farewell. 
forthwith shall be the arrival of my Savior Emmanuel, and he shall engulf this world with his plan of love and light, henceforth sealing the door where evil dwells. Alas, I shall not dim it from my walk, for it to beguile me hauntingly shall that come to pass. For I see the light of my Lord Jesus even beyond expiry. Tis the estate and expectations of heaven and the egad expression of praise that I give it to my Savior endlessly. My love, do not hasten to make yourself immed immedicable. Suffice it to say that I shall every day on your behalf pray and shall us in deepest orison and perchance you will join me on that great getting up day. Amen. Love you, me, however you are. God is with you.